Greetings from Kyiv. Thanks to Minister Alexander Yelovsky for inviting me to join the conference. And sorry for not attending it in person. Ukraine is in the middle of the most technologically advanced war in human history. This is the war of drones, robotics, AI and satellite communications. It's fair to say that we became the trendsetters in terms of future of warfare. Besides the war, we also try to keep the pace of global trends, in particular in areas of AI, cybersecurity and data storage. As for artificial intelligence, while it concurs world's attention with ChatGPT, BART, Midjourney and other solutions, there is still a big issue remaining the regulation of this sector. Ukraine works on it. Recently, we presented the roadmap for regulation AI in Ukraine based on a bottom-up approach. It includes two stages. During first, we will provide businesses with tools and recommendations. The second stage is the adopt of a law similar to the European AI Act to create identical legal regimes with the EU, simplify cooperation and attract investments. We believe in responsible AI using and aim to provide the highest possible level of human rights protection. Another big focus for us is cybersecurity. It's the foundation of the digital state. And all the services and products we launch are designed considering the latest cybersecurity innovations. We are creating secure by design state. It used to be and remains our main principle. Speaking of government cybersecurity, we also have to mention the data storage. Ukraine has quite a unique experience in a short amount of time with transfer state registers and database to the private clouds such as Amazon, Microsoft, Google and Oracle. This was a life-saving decision. Ukraine has a lot to offer. We are ready to share the best practices with the world. At the same time, Ukraine is open to testing more technologies and products on the battlefield and beyond. Let's build future together. Slava Ukraini!